I have another YouTube channel where I review products and here is a product of mine that I have made recently. This is a microphone review. So if you are making review videos, you may know you need a lot of B-rolls, right? So if I show you, here is a V-roll. Again, here is another V-roll. Again, here is a V-roll. But the problem is when you are recording the B-rolls, sometimes you may record the V-rolls in slow motion version. Suppose I am using a Sony camera. So whenever I am recording V-rolls, I usually use SNQ mode. And if you're recording the video using SNQ mute, you'll get ready-made slow motion video. You don't need to slow it down when you are editing. But the problem is whenever you are recording the video in normal FPS, suppose you're recording the video in 60 FPS or 120 FPS with audio, then you need to slow it down in the editing process, right? So here I have made a project for you. If I close this project, okay, so here is our project. This is a 24 fps sequence right so if i show you the sequence settings this is a 23.976 fps sequence so whenever i am dragging something here the video need to be prepared for 24 fps sequence right so if you are recording the video in slow motion in snq mode you don't have any problem because when you are going here then you can just select a video suppose this one and to use this one if i play it back you'll see it is already slowed down right so suppose i want to use this portion so if i just make a in point and then out point i can click and drag it here on my timeline and it will be played normally right already slowed down version but the problem is i have already recorded some video in 60 fps here is the video in 60 fps normal video you can see a lot of motions again another one so i need to slow it down when i am editing to slow it down what you can do you can click and drag the video here then you can just click keep existing settings and there you can right click and go to speed and duration you can slow it down maybe 50 percent then okay right now the video is slowed down right but suppose you are working with 50 clips or 100 clips you need to do it for every single clips but there is a solution that you can follow suppose i want to slow down all of this clip at once right what i can do this is actually 60 fps video right very fast again this one is also fast so i want to slow it down at once so select the clips that you want to slow down then right click go to modify and then interpret footage and from here you can select the frame rate that you want Suppose this video have been recorded in 60 fps, but you want to use these clips in 24 fps sequence, right? So you can just click here and then you can type 24 or 23.976, whatever you want. And then if you click OK, now if you play back any of this video, you can see this video have been slowed down already. You don't need to slow it again, right? You can just click in and out and then you can click and drag it here on your timeline then play it back the video is ready to use right so that is how you can slow down all the clips in your project panel at once without any issue that is all for today i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up if you know this channel want to learn adobe premiere for video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more awesome video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye